<laughs> Oliver had been to the works to be screwed up in a good way. Some asshole cars fucked him up, making him fall into the turntable well. FUCKING HELL! Now Oliver was as sexy as ever, but he was still worried about cars. I'd rather die than use those motherfuckers again! But cars sang slanderous songs insultingly. Scruffy, their leader, led the taunt. <laughs> Oliver's just a garbage can, he thinks he's very strong. He says he can fuck all of us, that's the best joke ever. When he fucks us all around with the greatest folly, we just pushed him down the well. Pop goes on Ollie. <laughs> SHUT UP! yelled the engines. But they couldn't be everywhere, and everywhere they weren't, the cars trolled again. Oliver's just a garbage can, he thinks he's very strong. He says he can fuck all of us, that's the best joke ever. <laughs> At last, the engines lost all hope and gave up. We're sorry, Oliver. It's really my fault, said Oliver sadly. I shouldn't have fallen in that stupid turntable wheel. That day fucking sucked. Toad the brake van felt sorry for Oliver too. Next morning, he spoke to Douglas. I'm worried, Mr. Douglas. This retired bullshit towards Angus need to stop. It really fucking does. I've got a plan, Mr. Douglas. May I stay here and help Mr. Oliver? We're both great western, must fight together, Toad said. Fuck me now, Toad. Of course! Really? No. Soon, Toad was explaining his plan. Great fuck, Toad. I don't think you should suggest that to Oliver. Oi! But Oliver interrupted. No, Doc. Toad's right. It really is my fucking fault. I must put it right! I really hope this works. That's all I have to say about that. Okay, Forrest Gump. Driver said the same. He got the station master to say yes immediately. The negotiations were short indeed. indeed he do but I must hurry. My passengers will be breaking things even if I'm a millisecond late.